It's your vibration reading for the Virgo Sun Moon and um, Sun Moon and Rising sign. It is the third week of November 2017, and um, I want to say thank you for returning. Thank you for supporting my channel, and um, I want to give a short message um, for the people who are living in the United States and you um, celebrate Thanksgiving. I'm asking each and every person to open up their heart and do a donation for the power of outreach um, church it is an apostolic church uh, this is a total different organization it is the energy of a church but yet still they support the homeless and they find um, housing for also the homeless so the church is there and also they help um, people to find temporary shelter and it is Thanksgiving um, on um, the fourth Thursday of this month and I'm asking each and every person to open up their hearts and uh, to donate something to help out if you if it's even a dollar every dollar helps there is a PayPal button on my channel so you can donate and this donation will go directly to the church it is the power outreach um, church and it is an apostolic church this is in Oakland um, um, Florida so for the rest of the people this is going to be a week of a lot of transition um, you have the energy vibration of the hangman in this week which is and water energy and you have the zodiac energy of also water and for yourself you have the nine of cups this is wonderful with the energy of the nine of cups for the people between the ages of 20 the people between the ages of 20 to 40 on Tuesday it's going to be a wonderful day the energy of the five of pentacles is here um, it's going to be on Thursday and then you have the energy of the Empress so um, there is a situation with um, um, you people because the earth sign seems to be having the five of pentacles and the sword energy so let's see what is happening for it. okay so that is um, good there is um, the ten of sword ten of Pentacles and the ten of swords together which is extremely good um, the king of cups is here and there is a victory and success so this is going to be a good week there's a lot of people a lot of um, number 10 is going to be your energy vibration 1 and 10 a lot of stuff is going on there is a situation that a lot of you um, hurt sign people are working with the Queen of Cups there's a lot of situation that you're working with the Queen of Cups this is really a straightforward reading so we're going to um, look on so number one and number ten is going to be your energy vibration number number ten comes up um, three times okay so this energy of the number ten is uh, ruins okay it is being stabbed in the back but it's okay because um, it is actually a situation where you are vibrating of much higher energy vibration and certain people cannot deal with your the the level of your uh, energy vibration because you're an earth sign and you feel as if you've been stabbed in the back and people are working against you let's look and see if that is a correct statement and I'm I'm receiving to take three cards no it's actually good it is actually good it is actually good um, what is happening is that um, you feel as if you've been stabbed in the back and people are working against you but that's not true because the energy of happiness the nine of cups is here for um, the man 
and this is good and whatever the situation is is that you're protected in this situation so whatever it is there is going to come happiness the nine of cups and then you have your own energy vibration the king of cups and you are being protected so whatever that you felt as if people were trying to work against you it's not true um, you are going to be okay for the people between the ages of 18 and uh, 18 and 40 this is a good sign for you because you are dreaming and the earth signs I mean you guys are just showing up in your readings you're dreaming of something better and you have the seven of cups so whatever it is a time of dreaming and manifesting so whatever you dream you're going to manifest this in reality and it's going to be very very good for you guys okay the middle of the week and the crowning of the week on Wednesday you have the fool's journey and whatever the oppression was the ten of ones whatever that was very oppressing and oppress you the energy of the fool is on a new journey and this positive new journey is going to bring you success in your life so whatever the oppressive feelings that you had and which you are going to be having this overall feelings in this week you need to know that your dreams are going to be coming through the reality of what your think you're feeling as if people are working against you it is absolutely not true on Thursday you have the energy of the five of Pentacles the energy of the five of Pentacles not to worry with this energy because what is happening is that you have financial security you have the ten of Pentacles coming up so um, whatever the hardship that you are feeling with your financial situation not to worry because the energy of the ten of Pentacles is coming up and it's going to help you to move you to a place of financial security as we look on Friday um, a good day because it's your day it's the energy of the temperance and you have the energy of the Queen of Cups now the energy of this Queen of Cups keep on coming up because um, this is uh, the Pisces the cancer and the scorpion and whatever the situation is and was you are going to be healing the situation with this person and you're going to be moving away from this person because whatever that was there trying to block you the Queen of Pentacles which is someone who could be um, a Taurus or a Capricorn or even another Virgo is going to come in and help you the weekend is the weekend of um, emotion my it's good emotion there is going to be a celebration with the king of cups so whatever that situation is whatever that celebration is there is going to be a positive celebration with the king of cups this is going to be good this is going to be very positive so this you are going to be seeing happening in your life and this is going to be extremely positive as we move forward on Sunday you have the four of cups and this is a wonderful thing you're looking back at the past and you're going to be victorious and you're going to move on a new journey so what is happening is that in this weekend is going to be a very positive weekend for you guys because whatever that has transpired over the time you are going to be moving away and your dreams will be manifesting and the reality of everything is that you are going to come out on top you're going to be victorious and come out on top this is actually a very positive reading for you Virgos so um, again the number one and the number ten is going to be a positive focus because the one is a new beginning and for the ten and the zero is going on a new journey so this is going to be positive this is a promising week for a lot of people you can see um, that things are happening as I look there is the energy of love in the weekend and this energy of love is going to be for the people who are connected with um, 
the Pisces the cancer and the scorpion this is going to be a wonderful positive connection and celebration um, some people are going to be planning their escape route from certain situation but it's going to be good it's going to be extremely good because you're going to see um, positive and good energies coming through so this is going to be wonderful whatever that is transpiring in your life it's going to come good um, so love is not really the focus is just going to balance the week because um, it's a water week so your weekend is going to bring emotional balance to yourself um, there's a lot of dreaming and manifestation and this is good so let's look at what um, the energies have for you Virgos in the third week and we have the five of water the five of water the five of cups um, is the energy so let's see what is happening with the energy of the five of water um, it is actually an in the week with the energy of water because whenever water comes up it is or cleansing of emotion you have the five of water release grief allow sadness to raise and fall forgiveness the evil and the flow of emotion you felt the fullness of your emotion as they wash through you the Hebrew and foe are part of life awaken you are present in your feelings today you fully um, regain consciousness of who you are and this is going to be extremely extremely good as we move on we are going to look to see what is the message uh, for your abundance in this week and let's see what message comes up for the Virgo for the abundance and you have quiet retreat quiet retreat so they're asking you it's time to discontent from the outer world so that you can discern and process your true thoughts and feelings from the inner world create this quiet time for yourself and you will have more clarity about how to get through this and this is going to be good so I want to say to each and every person please remember um, to support the homeless and also um, to support this um, this Thanksgiving and please um, like share these videos and I'm saying namaste until next time